The BMT-1 is a Soviet-era airborne infantry fighting vehicle designed to support airborne troops in combat operations. It has a distinctive appearance characterized by its compact size, low profile, and track traces. Its compact design and lightweight construction allow it to be airdropped from transport aircraft, making it an essential component of airborne assault operations. The BMT-1 entered into service with the Soviet Army Airborne Units in 1969 and was first shown to the public during a parade held in Moscow in November 1973. Development started in 1965 and limited production began in 1968 and ended in 1969. After Operation Charles, it was deployed in limited numbers by 1969 and the serial production started in 1970. The BMT-1 can be thought of as a BMP intended for airborne troops. The vehicle therefore must be lighter and smaller in order to meet air drop weight requirements. The vehicle weighs only 7.5 tons with a length of 5.41 meters, a width of 2.53 meters, and a height of 1.97 meters. It has a welded aluminum armor hull. The hull is bulky to render the vehicle amphibious. Hull was reinforced to withstand landings. It seems that front arc provides protection against 12.7mm rounds. Own rail protection is against small arms fire and anterior shell splinters. This airborne combat vehicle is fitted with automatic fire suppression and NBC protection systems. This vehicle is vulnerable to anti-tank mines. The crew consists of four soldiers driver, commander, gunner, and bow machine gunner, two of which are included in the number of soldiers carried. The driver's station is located centrally in the front of the vehicle and has a hatch that is opened by raising it and rotating it to the right. The vehicle is provided with three periscope vision blocks which allow him to view the outer environment when his hatch is closed. The BMT-1 has the same turret as the BMP-1. It is armed with a 73mm 2A28 Grom gun and a 7.62mm PKT coaxial machine gun. Mounted on the mainlet is the 9S428 ATGM launcher capable of firing 9M14 Maluetka and 9M14 M Maluetka M ATGMs. There are also two 7.62mm PKT machine guns in fixed mounts, one in each corner of the bow. The vehicle is powered by a 5D26 cylinder four-stroke V-shaped liquid cone 15.9 liter diesel engine, which developed 270 horsepower. The engine drives manual gearbox with five forward and one reverse gear. The BMT-1 has a maximum road speed of 80 km per hour, reduced to around 45 km per hour off-road and 10 km per hour while swimming. The BMT-1 is fully amphibious. On water, it is propelled by two water jets. Compared to the other Eastern Bloc infantry fighting vehicles and armor personnel carriers, the BMT-1 has been produced in relatively small numbers for the former Soviet Army Air Assault Divisions. It has been exported to Cuba, India, Iran, and Iraq. After the collapse of the Soviet Union, this vehicle was passed on to some of the former Soviet republics.
the BMT-1 has seen action during some wars. Today, major operators of this airborne combat vehicle are Azerbaijan, Belarus, Iran, Moldova, Ukraine, and Uzbekistan. Most of the Russian BMT-1s are in storage, and newer vehicles are used. Russia and China are the only countries that design new dedicated airborne combat vehicles. Overall, the BMD-1's appearance reflects its role as a highly mobile and agile ammo vehicle tailored to the specific needs of airborne forces, providing air support and troops transport capabilities in airborne assault missions. The BMT-1 played a significant role in the Soviet and Russian airborne operations and remained an iconic symbol of airborne warfare.